Hey everybody, it's Dr. Magnifico from jaredsbullvetandpobbly.com. This is Hank. He's an eight-year-old male neutered beagle. He came to me 17 days ago. Um, he was unable to stand or walk or move. He was paralyzed. He was incredibly painful. Um, he came to me and his owners were unable to afford referral to a neurologist. I suspected he had an intervertebral disc lesion on the right side in the cervical area, so the right side of his neck. Um, that caused him to be unable to stand or walk. Um, he was, they were unable to afford the referral to a neurologist, which is about $2,500 for an MRI to diagnose this and then about $7,000 in my area to do surgery. Um, he came to stay with me. He's been with me for about the last two weeks. Um, in that time, he's done remarkably well. So you can see he's up walking, he's moving, he's comfortable, he's very short footed, he's urinating and defecating, which actually he was doing from the beginning, which is a a really good sign. Um, this is the last video I'm going to do on him. He's going to head back to his home, but I wanted to let you guys see how well he's doing. Um, you know, I really firmly believe that this disease is, in most cases, it is it is treatable and it is curable. Um, it does take a lot of dedication and TLC on both your part and your veterinarian's part, um, and a lot of determination. It's really a hard one to watch, but there are lots of options and there are lots of affordable options. I've got quite a few blogs on Hank, um, quite a few videos, and quite a lot of information on intervertebral disc disease. Um, please reach out to me at any time if you've got questions, and please don't give up on your pup. Um, they can make amazing recoveries, uh, and it's really, it's, a, it's really nothing short of a miracle if you'll just try and give them some time and some TLC. Um, you know, Hank's been doing really well, and we're just going to monitor him in the future. I don't really want him doing too much over-extenuating ex um, or exertion of running or jumping or playing too hard. I don't want him really walking upstairs unattended or downstairs. I'm afraid he'll trip and fall. We've got to keep him on a good flea and tick pre preventative. He came with, with both and um, Lyme disease, which certainly didn't help. <clears throat> but as you can see, he is peeing comfortably. He's doing all the things that a beagle does and he's happy, happy. Shaking the head is a big one. Um, that used to be really painful for him. If you have any questions, you can find me at pobbly.com um, or find a lot of information on diarrhea of a real life veterinarian if you search intervertebral disc disease. Take care and wish Hank well. He's got hopefully a long, happy road of many, many years ahead of him. Take care. Bye. Hank. Come on, Hank. Come on. Good boy. Come on, Hank.